What message does this send children with teachers walking off their jobs and taking, taking uh, school children down to protest? Well, they're not necessarily taking the school children down to protest. Well, actually, uh, we've actually probably... heard, with, with great respect, we've actually heard from a number of students on camera saying, I don't really know why I'm here. I'm here to protest, whatever that guy's trying to do. The teacher's taking him out of class. School's shut down. I'm just asking what the example that's being said is. Actually, I don't, I don't believe teachers are taking pupils down. Well, that's what the it's pupils said. So either Shepherd, they're lying probably, or you're mistaken. Shepard, it's probably parents taking their kids down there. But that's not what the kids said. Their own but kids be that down. as it may, so, continue. All right. Uh, I don't know what it says to, to students aside from the fact that sometimes this is how democracy works. And, and sometimes it's loud, sometimes there's, there's crowds, sometimes there isn't. But at the very least, it's saying to kids, this is how demo democracy works sometimes. If the governor doesn't sit down, will you go back to Madison and get this done? And if not, how late will you stay away? How long will you stay away? Again, you know, I would love to sleep in my own bed tonight. I'm afraid that, that that's probably not going to happen. Again, I, this goes back to the governor. The so governor you're not going to answer how long it is you're willing to, to hold out here? Well, we don't, we don't know. I mean, that, that's totally I mean, up to the might governor. Might you hold it's out for days? That, might you hold out for weeks? Shepard, again, that's up to the governor. When the governor is willing to sit down and really try and build consensus and, and, and take a look at the legislation, exactly how it affects Wisconsin, and try and bring us together, then, then that's a great movement forward.